Welcome to this Make It Monday. I'm Kieran Phipps, the vinyl segment specialist. And let's make a fun trick or treat bag for Halloween. So Caesar came out with Easy Glow years back and it was white and it would glow green. And this year they came out with some very fun colors, neon green, a neon yellow, a neon pink and an orange. And then there's also a neon blue. This material is uh, like an easy weed. It's not necessarily any thicker than an easy weed. So whenever you're cutting it on your cutter, you can cut it on your easy weed setting. And, uh, but always test your cutter first, especially when you're doing a new material. So you can make sure that you do in fact have uh, the proper uh, blade depth. Now I put a weed box on this one so that I could make sure I had enough space. Okay, so as I'm reading this last piece, a weed box, whenever you are cutting a, an item, especially if there's like a bunch of items or maybe you're just trying to fit something on, a weed box is actually a cut that goes around your design and that way you can just weed out what you need. And the weed box is especially, like I said, whenever you are using scraps, um, it actually kind of makes sure that you've got everything in there that you need. So that's the advantage of using a weed box. All right, so now that we've got this weeded, we're gonna go ahead and get this pressed. It is 305 for 15 seconds. Um, I'm putting it on this uh, canvas tote bag, so I'm definitely going to use a heat press pillow whenever I'm pressing this to make sure that all the seams are um, not gonna show up whenever I press. So I'm gonna get that popped in. Now then, this is a warm to cold peel. So as I am doing this, especially with these many colors, um, I've got to be mindful that if I start noticing some of it peeling up a little bit whenever I'm pulling that carrier away, I really want to make sure that um, I wait and let it cool off a little bit and then press it just for a few more seconds afterwards to really tack that down. All right, let's see how this goes. Yeah, we're definitely going to have to let that cool off before I can pull that carrier. All right, so we wanna make sure that this cools down um, enough that we can peel this carrier. It's a warm to cool peel, so definitely not hot peel. And if you notice that it's coming up a little bit, then wait just a moment for it to cool off a little bit more before you start peeling again. So let's see. And if a, a little part does pull up, you can tack it back down with a quick little press. All right, so now that we have that main part on, we can get these other items on. Now, the cool thing about these colors is, unlike the other that is white and glows green, these are actually gonna glow the color that they are. So we'll have a cool glowing pink, green, yellow, and then there's that blue and the orange. They'll be super fun for Halloween. Okay, remember, warm to cold peel. So we're gonna let that cool off just a few moments and then we will peel this off. Okay, so now that this is cooled off, I can now go ahead and pull that carrier off. It's very exciting. So uh, you definitely wanna put this in the sun. It needs to get some UV rays in it so that it is, becomes the glow effect. So after you make your bag or put this on a shirt or whatever fun projects you're gonna do, you wanna put it outside, let it absorb some of the UV uh, rays, and then it will really glow in the dark. Be sure to tune in next week for another fun Make It Monday project. Also be sure to like, subscribe, uh, and comment. Let us know what you think about this new product, especially if you've done something, share it with us. We'd love to see. Uh, also, be sure to check out our website, gogsg.com, so you can order the new Easy Glow today. We'll see you again next week.